Taylor, it's Jake. Just wanted to say I am so glad that we met. I mean, I hope you don't think it's all business with me. I really want to be friends. Who? You know, brother, it's show business got to keep some real people around. You know what I mean, my sister? I know what you mean, my brother. So, yo, you just have fun and peace. Come on, Candace, now how tired can you be? You just got back from Bermuda. I'm the one two steps from a stroke. You know, look, it's my magazine, which means they're my precious. Bullshit. It may say George Winston Enterprises on the cover, but it's 12 years of my blood, sweat, and tears up in here, George. Baby, I know. Now, look, I'll wine and dine you. Now, I know I haven't been doing that lately. You haven't been doing much of anything lately. You know I'm not the passionate type. I never have been. Well, that's the truest thing you've ever said. You don't even have any passion for Meridian. Well, that's fine, because when I'm gone... Oh, oh, you won't leave. When I am gone, you will need some passion to screw some new idiot into running this magazine. The only satisfaction I get these days. It's a great fall cover, but you really have to hurry. Nicole, get my son on the phone. You don't have enough time, Mrs. Montgomery. And besides, he's in production. Yeah, right. All right. Okay, work the eyes, girls. Hey, Safia. A little more, baby. Put your chin down. Safia, lips, Safia. Look up. Oh, beautiful. Hold on, pick it up. Yes, beautiful. Fabulous. Fabulous. She would get her poses out of it. Little more attitude. Mm. Yeah. Nice. Little pal. Chin down. Just a little bit. Hello, Tammy. Hello. How are you doing? Give me a little more in those eyes. Give me some love. Beautiful. Yeah, that's beautiful. Gorgeous. Beautiful something. Beautiful. Hello, Tammy. Hello, darling. Yeah. Eyes. Uh-huh. Gorgeous. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay, that's it, Tammy. Uh-huh. One more. Just like that. Hold it. Yeah, beautiful. Okay, ladies, take five. I shot that, that cover. What do you think? I published it. It's one of my favorites. It reminds me of my son. I love your work. How's the shoot going? It's going great. Do you mind? Well... <sighs> I'm Jella James. I'm Candace Montgomery. Yes, I know. It's a pleasure. Ooh. Bless you. I should have caught a snap of that. <laughs> Please tell me you have some tissue. Um, no, this isn't happening. Uh, yes, it's happening. Here you go. I can't use your scarf. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I, 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 I can. I'll buy you another one. Thank you. And they said chivalry was dead. I will buy you another scarf. And I'll take you lunch, if you have time. Well, you're the boss. Do I? Yes. I didn't do that. Okay. Thanks. Oh, bye. I am so sorry about that. You know this business and its drama. Oh, I know. I'm working with Miss Drama Queen. Now, who could that be? Tammy put on quite a show, didn't she? Yeah, she's good at that. She is a pretty girl. She's gone far. 
She'd be glad to hear you say so. But you know, we know her story. What's yours? Oh, I don't know. Like okay, all right, here we go. Um, the brilliant editor of Meridian Magazine is here to tell us losers to just get it right, damn it. Damn right. <laughs> you know, I should just pass the hell out from even sitting next to you. I, um, I think that you've done a great job with Meridian. And I just wanted to say thank you for all the work that you've given me. Well, passing out is extreme. And you don't owe me things. I owe you one. Your work is great, Taylor. It's some of the best I've ever seen. Thank you. You are welcome. Can I give you two anything else? Oh, no, no, just a check. Thank you. Have a nice evening. Yeah. Thank you. Boy, I hate these press junkets. I feel like an anvil has dropped on my neck. It's so tense. It feels like stone. I know, Graham Seuss, if you're interested. I may have to get that number. Look, I gotta run to this reception for the drama queens. Somebody's gotta remind them to be beautiful inside as well as out. But please, stop by later, and we'll have a drink, and then you can tell me how I can get some more photos of yours in the magazine. I'd love to stop by. Where are you staying? Oh, here, let me give you the address. You know, Candace, I will uh, give you any photo that you want. If you let me take some of you. Candace, who reminds you that you're beautiful? Look, I gotta go manufacture a smile for these people. Thank you again for the scarf. Candace, you are beautiful inside as well as out. And you're very much welcome for the scarf. Thank you. That was very sweet. Let me take this. Bye now. Son, I wanted to call you before you left L.A., but you were, I remembered you were in production. Yeah, well, I really needed to hear from you today. Oh, uh, uh, hell, as usual. And he's hell, as usual. Uh, so, any um, daughter-in-law potential happening anytime soon? Oh. She is. Well, does she think you're as wonderful as you do? Because you know I do, but I'm your mother. It, the, I have a visitor. No, nothing like that. Uh, well, good. We'll have dinner when you get back to L.A. Okay. I love you too, baby. Bye-bye. Just a minute! I was wondering if you were going to make it. Oh, well, I hope it's not too late. Are you kidding? Of course not. Come in. Oh, um, this is, uh, for you. Thank you. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> oh, I love this show. I love how he captured his face. You can feel his spirit. And then everything you shoot, Taylor, you can feel the spirit. I'm just lucky I caught it. Yeah, actually, that's my aim. You know, I, I want people to be able to feel my work. You have a, a very lovely place. Thanks. I enjoy it when I'm here. Oh, please, sit down. Okay. Giovanni, I love her. Oh, she is definitely one of my favorites. So how long have you been into photography? Oh, God. 
since forever. Um, when I was a child, I got a camera for my birthday, and I've been taking photos ever since. I took that camera everywhere. Everywhere? Everywhere, even to the bathroom. <laughs> if I wasn't taking photos, I was telling bad jokes. You know, anything to get people to smile? Oh, God, and I'm... Here's the bad joke. Okay, um... You ready? Um... There's a little boy named Paquito, and Paquito has to pass this whorehouse every time he goes to school. And there's this big, fat whore sitting on the banister. She's got herself wrapped up in a robe, and he passes by, and she says, Hello, Paquito. Hello, hello, little boy. Hello, little boy. Paquito sees her, and he runs to school. Next day, he passes by. There she is again. Hello, little boy. Hello, little boy. This goes <laughs> on forever. Days and days and days and days and days. One day, Paquito passes by, and he's hoping she's not there. She's still there, and she's standing there. Hello, little boy, hello, little boy. Paquito gets a ball of nerves. He says, lady, lady, how come every time I pass by your house, you always go, hello, little boy, hello, little boy. And he sa she says, it's because uh, you have such a small penis. <laughs> Paquito's completely offended. He runs off to school. Next day, he passes by, and there she is again. Hello, little boy, hello, little boy. Paquito says, Hello, lady. <laughs> <laughs> it was bad, I told you. Yeah. <laughs> no, it was good. You make me laugh as hard as my son. <laughs> <laughs> you have a baby? Oh, that's right. You mentioned, you mentioned him earlier. Oh, he's far from being a baby. I mean, he's in his 20s. Ooh. You must make it very tough on his girlfriend. Oh, you know, he does have a hard time keeping one. <laughs> yeah. Tell me about your work. I mean, you're very talented. You could do anything you want with your photography. Actually, I have this assignment that I'm interested in, and I hope it works out for me. What assignment is that? I don't know where you my stuff. May I have some wine? Of course. Could afford it sooner. <laughs> Can I give you a hand with that? I think I got it. This is a lovely one. Please, read it. Um, we are not lovers because of the love we make, but the love we have. We are not friends because of the laughs we spend, but the tears we save. I don't want to be near you for the, the thoughts, thoughts we, we share, share, but for the, the words, words we never have to speak. I love poetry. <gasps> so do I. Oh, tightness. My neck. You know, you suck. I can I can work on that if you like. I have a massage license. I, I got one on the side. I get bored of it. And I thought I was a jack of all trades. Well, it's past bothering me. You sure you don't mind? I don't mind at all. Now, I know you know everything there is to know about photography, but are you sure you can really work this Just back of mine? Trust me. It's a shame I don't get these more often. It's getting late. <clears throat> I should go. Okay. Well, uh, 
Thanks for stopping by. No problem. Relax, no, 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 relax. I'll let myself out. You okay? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, prime time drama. You were late. My mommy always said, leave trash where you find it. You're an artist. You make beauty out of trash. Yeah, but your hands get a little dirty. How's your neck? Mm. Mm. This side's good. It's she, the other side that's a problem. Glad you came from the house. Everybody should, especially me. What do you want from me, dear? Why'd you come to me tonight? I dreamt of you last night. That's funny. I dreamt of you too. What did you dream about? I was combing your hair, strand by strand. Do you saw a line at the hairdresser too? <laughs> Just a fantasy. I dreamed about your hands. You really want to comb my hair?
candid. There's something so special about you. Why is it so hard for me to believe you? You shouldn't need anyone to show you, but since you do, I want to. This doesn't happen, Taylor. What's happening? If you leave tomorrow, one kiss wouldn't be enough. Are you coming on to me? 